What are you doing? So, what can we do about it? If I were you, I would deal with the strange heat signature by the cargo bay first. Cargo bay? Fuck! Let's go! Take it. Head out the way. I love how the Zen apparently Get have testicles me. right where the things do. Kinsey okay? Everyone's fine. The Zin grabbed me and... Hey, Sid said something about heat signatures? One of them put a device on the wall. I'm not sure what it is. What device? We got bombs over here. Bombs? Yeah. And they're set to blow. You thinking what I'm thinking? Keep an eye on Kinsey, Shondi. Johnny and I are about to do something really stupid. You got a specific thing you want to blow up, or just shit in general? Kinsey, what's the weakest point in the Zin ship? Yo, boss, Kinsey's... Fuck. I... Look, we'll just find the biggest glowingest thing on the ship and stick the bombs to that. Fair enough. These Zins sure do make a good argument for murdering them. Oh, they're nothing compared to their leader. I am going to enjoy every second of tearing Zinyak apart. Take your time, huh? That sounds like a plan. You get the chance? I'm going to rip Zinyak's goddamn head off. Yo, where do you think the Zin had Kinsey? I don't know. But when I find Matt and Asha, I'm going to beat that information out of him. Maybe, maybe not. Good one. Yo, we got some alien gun over here. Hello, but welcome back, huh, Johnny? Fuck, you were thinking I wanted to go to Hawaii or something? I live for this shit. That's what's up. They're playing dubstep. Is that very alien dubstep? Do you know? Cylinder, huh? Big and glowing. Looks perfect. Oh, man. That one. Here you go. Need to find something that looks important. I like how we don't move slow with these many guns. Get in here. Get out. Whoa. That wasn't a bad fuck you to Zinyak. Now let's get out of here and find Kinsey. Yep. God damn it! What happened? MI6 fucked us. I knew it! Asha had it out for me since jump. She talked shit in Pakistan. She sucker punched me. Can't believe Miller had me fooled. To think I actually apologized. He's probably been working this angle for a while. Hell, he might have even been the one who tipped off Zinyak about Johnny. Doubt it. Dante said that the lowest circle of hell was reserved for betrayers. But it's important to remember that it's the storyteller who decides who the hero is, not morality. But while philosophers will spend years debating the ethics of the Kinsey Gambit, 
The Saints had a less charitable view. Keith David is a dead man. What? Oh. Keith David. I never would have called that. I know, right? Health pickups value. I need to better familiarize myself with how the simulation works. I figure if I watch the changes to the code take place when you do a few different tasks for me, I should get a stronger grasp on the workings of Zen programming. Fine, but I better get something out of this. Okay. to collect like five more clusters. You are cordially invited to the swearing in of Super President for Life, Keith David, today at the Federal Building. Attendance is mandatory. Have a nice day. Yeah. The resident. President of what? The Earth is gone. Create his own. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Hold on. Force shield. Alright. I'm good now. firsthand what this war with the Zen has cost us. How many more need to die before we realize that the time has come for us to put aside our pride and focus not on division, but unity? Does Zinyak have a strong personality? Absolutely. But then again, so did the previous president. And you know what? When I look at the two of them, I see more similarities than differences. Both have proven leadership experience. Both maintain their composure in high-pressure situations. Both have a love of Jane Austen. But most importantly, <laughs> Both of them will not stop until they get what they want. For this war to end, we need to stop rattling sabers and realize that victory doesn't come from annihilating an enemy, but by making an enemy your friend. All of us are heroes in our own stories. The time has come for us to grow up and have perspective. Earth will have its salvation, but it will come on the back of humility 
not violence. Cute speech. Where's the part where you talk about selling out humanity? Humanity? Does that mean the nine of us? Earth is gone because you provoked a madman. I trusted you, Keith. And I trusted you. The country trusted you. And look where that led us. So what, you're putting your faith in Zinyak? Giving up your free will to be ruler of some bullshit daydream? You don't get it. Zinyak said he can restore Earth. All I have to do is kill you. He's lying what? to you. Maybe. But there's billions of lives at stake. If he's telling the truth, what's one life for the greater good? You sound just like Julius. He was right. Who's just talking about when he says Julius for Lyman? Oh. Whoa. I'm so confused right now. We had a deal, my friend. I don't even care. Now what am I supposed to do with a naughty little boy like you? Ah. Enjoy your requiem, Mr. Pig. <laughs> you think for all the trouble we caused, he would just kill us? You there? Matt? Matt? Oh shit. Clearly that didn't work out. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Roddy Piper! Son of a bitch! I'm trying to save your life. You couldn't even save your own. Keith, listen to me. I'm giving you a choice. Get away from me! Oh, he has superpowers, but we don't. They have him bad. Hey, I'm Roddy. Roddy Piper. Hey, I'm the president of the United States. Sure. Why not? <laughs> well, Prez, we got visitors. 
snap you man. That's why I get paid the big bucks. He sold out someone very important. Whatever trance he's in, I need him snapped out of it. He's going crazy. He thinks we're yep. all out to kill him. It got 20% to cool. Kinsey, I will be. Yeah. What is this place? A television broadcasting tower. What the hell's he gonna do with the broadcast tower? He's a crazy man with a microphone. What do you think he's gonna do? Ladies and gentlemen of America, the threat is right in front of us. An alien presence has taken over your friends and family. You got it all wrong, Keith. Zinyak's in your head. He's got you all confused. Keith, listen to me. This Zinyak guy is bad fucking news. You! I told you to get away! Get the fuck away from me! You're not gonna kill me, motherfucker! Shit! He's headed for the roof! Better you than me! Soon! The whole world will know the truth! The satellite's what's controlling, Keith. You take care of it, I'll handle it. I'll take out the CIDs. The what? Never mind, I got this. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> but at this point, he's like, whatever. That worked. That was a little different now. Why am I using that? I know this notice the stairs going up. There you go. Just like Johnny Tommy. All right. You did it. The shield's down. Suck it. What? Sorry, I'm trying. There's a lot of them. Did it work? No, the brainwashing is too ingrained. I'll have to feed it up. If you want to know where your friend is, now's the time to ask. Where is Kenzie, Keith? Where did Zinyak put Kenzie? Tell me, Keith! She's here. She's... She's in... Here go. <laughs> the broken chalele. Keith, I think you got some unresolved issues. You don't know what happened, kid. Now come on, we've got to save Kinsey. Wish we could call Roddy for help. No one calls Roddy for help. He shows up where he's needed most. Let's go. Whatever.
Super homie, Keith David. Homie, Roddy Piper. Yeah. Yeah. It's amazing. Sure, why not? It never really, yeah, it never really came to the forefront of my mind. But now we got as well, got him as a homie. Sure. He was rowdy before rowdy was cool. See, I'm gonna give me one of those. Yeah. See, what is it under? Oops. Yeah, found it. Set it. I that damage. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Can I upgrade? Can I give it myself? Okay, no, we're not. Wrong button. Damn, that is expensive. Sure. The uh, explosive whoops, fifty thousand. No, I ain't got the money. I know, right? <laughs> I'll freeze frame it. I may not know art. I know that sucked. I wonder how fly I could. F oh, not very far. Man, if I could get some real distance to this, I could just fly to any destination I wanted. Wait, let me try that. See how well that works. All the way over there. Oh, I can't even see that. It's fine, whatever. I'll go right there. Whoa! It, it runs out. <laughs> if you hold yourself up in the air too long, it, it runs out. I, I didn't even know that. Now I do. Oh, 
wait, it was down. I didn't even notice. Then we probably have the final mission. The information I got from Keith was a code of some kind. Apparently, he overheard Zinyak telling one of his subordinates a series of numbers somehow connected to Kinsey's location. Uh, I'd bet these digits line up with some proprietary coordination system used by the simulation, but I don't have access to that. We need someone who's able to plug directly into the simulation. Send the data to Sid. We'll take it from there. There you go. Data received. Hmm. Very interesting. It seems. Ah! Oh shit! What's happening? I don't know. I, I, I. Oh, here I go. Uh, Matt, I'm following Sid. I'm going to hack the code to find out where Sid is going. Don't touch anything. Why not? If he finds out where he's going, we can just meet him there. Kenzie had a thing for bunnies. If I had to guess, it looks like this sigil is connected to some sort of secret room. Secret room. Clever girl. Time to see what's in it. Oh, this is very exciting. Well, now. Isn't that interesting? Are you sure this is the right place? Absolutely. What the fuck is all this? A map of the simulation. Where are all the broken shillelaghs? If it would make the map more understandable to you, I could create a holocaust. God, no, we're good. So can you find Kinsey? In theory, yes. The time-consuming part will be identifying Kinsey's brainwaves in a sea of other data. Find whatever looks the most abnormal. It's probably her. Insulting, yet accurate. Good luck. Huh. True enough. Truth, this place. Oh my f me. Kenzie, great, come on, let's get out of here. If you want to speak with my husband, he'll be home this afternoon. Kenzie? Say, I'm afraid I don't have much of a green thumb. Oh, can you help me get this bulb to sit right? This is Kenzie's hell. No, Kenzie, I can't. What? <laughs> What are you doing? Hurry! I'm being held captive by... Kinsey? What just happened to Kinsey? Ooh, that must have been a decoy. That's smart. Huh. See if there are any more around. Oof! I like how I can just jump in the side window right past you. That's great. Happens to me all the time. Matt, I found another Kenzie. I wait. Ah, oh, sh. What's going on? <laughs> oh man, I wish we could just visit it when I was. have Kenzie. Yeah. I'm supposed to be shooting at it. Oh, my, my weapons are locked. Curse these nano machines. That was so wonky. Uh, sorry, didn't catch that. Good to be the president. That's what you get for driving on the side of the fing car. 
it straight. <laughs> I really hope this is the real you. Golly, that bump sure was a doozy, wasn't it? Get to City Hall. Hurry. Okay. Uh... Do you remember Cyrus Temple? Ooh, oh, the thug who launched a nuclear missile to take out America because he's a big baby that hates losing? Yeah, name rings a bell. He's in charge here. Are you serious? Wait, should he be dead? Not in Kinsey's mind, no. Oh, Kinsey. We're gonna have a long discussion after this. Don't worry, not like we need insurance here. If you go you done. I think it's dead now. There he is, Cyrus Temple. That was amazing. Glad I got out the car to see for? that. Cyrus says Kenzie. Matt, give me a gun. I can't. God it, Matt, give me something. Our women and children are not subject to the devilish influences of outside. What the f was that? Yeah, speaker boxes all over town. If you really want to shut him up, you have to take them all out. I will enforce the rules that make our society the well-oiled machine it needs to be in order for us to all possibly. Oh, it does nothing. For us to confuse the natural order. Men are built for labor. It shows in our Matt, man, come on. You've got to give me some kind of weapon. I'm telling you, this simulation is locked. We oh, oh, wait a minute. Excited, Matt. This can't be good. I've left you something in a weapons crate. Women of the support system. It is their duty to make sure the I'll needs of our weapon. home are met. It falls on them to raise children who are a music gun. Seriously, Matt. I told you no weapons allowed. But the power of music can overcome all obstacles. Fuck it, I'm in. Music gun it is. Zemus was straighten this bloke out. Propaganda truck, huh? Come at me. There are two more. I get the one on the left. What just happened? Yes, I can stop the signal. One more to go. Oh. Now. 
Nobody that was a freak that. accident. <laughs> Are you serious? Gives. I can't move the camera around. Wow. Matt, I'm headed back to Cyrus. Time for the second part of this plan. Which is... Trust me, you'll like it. Yeah! Let's dance! That's it. This ends now, you hoodlum. You wanna dance? Dance with me. Hey, I've got a new track for you to try. A new track? I'm uploading it now. Give it a shot. You're available for parties at Bar Mitzvahs. Also, this, the track changes whenever you press my other weapon. When you change the look of it. That's pretty cool. Let's get the fuck out of here. I like this. No, the the track that I was just playing. Yeah. Kinsey, you're okay. You don't tell anyone what you saw. Do you understand me? Kinsey, it really wasn't all that. I said anyone. Hey, you got it. Just saying, it was a cute poodle skirt. Oh. Thirty-two. Weapon. Dubstep gun. I think. Then why did we get it early? He was like already there. Oh, must be a glitch or something we downloaded, maybe. Poodle skate. Super homie Kenzie. That's great. Upgrade. Health. Save my hand to get that. Powers. Okay. So I'll stop right here. You can get a nuke upgrade. For the death from above, you need f you need to be level fifty, and it costs fifty clusters. Uh, it's in powers, the death from above one. That's the one where you hold it. 
that nuke. That is so awesome. Uh, you really gotta work for that one, though. Oh. I'll pick somebody else. Who's in here? Nobody is in here. Huh? Oh, if only. There's a blow up sex doll over here. I didn't even notice that before. Wow. Probably because every single time I win in that room, I'll. All I did was see Keith David. Been a hell of a ride, hasn't it? That is an understatement. You've changed so much. We both have. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, whatever happened with that guy who won your dating show? Puerto Rican Thunder God? He was sweet and all, but performance didn't live up to the name. Look, I gotta tell you something. It always drove me crazy that you had exes in every city and were willing to go on a dating show, but not once did you ever give me a shot. I'm asking now. 